y'all welcome back to my channel janae 21 here okay you guys oh my god back with another video oh my god so it is 24 weeks already like i can't believe it's 24 weeks already y'all yes so i'm six months i'm in my second trimester at the end of my second trimester and you guys oh my god i got a list because Jesus, 24 weeks, this little boy is giving me a run for my money. Also, um, oh, I can't remember what I was about to say. See, pregnancy brain. But anyway, yes, you guys, thank you for coming back to my channel to watch another video with your girl, Janae, 21. And so this video is going to be about my six-month update. Okay, you guys, so let's get right into it. So I am currently 24 weeks and about four days so in a few days i will be 25 weeks this is just crazy okay anyway okay you guys so the last video i left off i was 23 weeks or 21 weeks i can't remember yeah my 21 weeks and so for the past um three weeks yeah i know how to do math <laughs> but anyway <laughs> For the past couple of weeks, you guys, he has been moving so much. Like, he was just moving literally like 10 minutes ago. But he is a busybody. He is totally different from my daughter. She did not start moving really until this time. He's been moving for like a good month now. And so, it's just like, oh, okay. And, if, you know, they're getting more prominent. I'm feeling them. He is like all the way down there, you guys. Just, you know feeling on the way <laughs> so i'm just like okay um also you guys he's getting heavier of course because he's growing but it is really like on my back like oh on my back and on my knees oh my god when y'all was pregnant did y'all have knee problems i'm like i ain't that old i'm only 28 years old what is going on here so yes junior is giving me a run for my money my knees is hurting my back is hurting y'all no joke i cannot stand up for a long time at all so it's just like okay let me go sit my butt down somewhere okay let, let me just go all right <laughs> um i've been feeling very tired you guys my sleep has been kind of off i've been going to bed um uh, well not this past week i've been going to bed around like 9 30 because i have not like having a toddler and then me being pregnant it's just a lot on me so I try to have her in the bed by 8, 8 30. And then I try to go to bed by 9, 9 30. I just be wore out from working full time. Mm, excuse me. From working full time and then coming home and doing mommy duties and stuff. So it's just a lot. So and then she's like almost two. So she's already the terrible part. So it's like, okay, little girl, go somewhere and sit down. But she's, you know. She know what she don't know, you know? So it's very trying time right now. Pray for me. Pray for you, girl. Okay. <laughs> um, Another thing I've been feeling is it says I feel like I'm not doing enough. And that is so true. Like, I feel like on one hand, I'm doing a lot as in like I'm working. I am uh, I'm working full time. Also, like, like I said, I have a toddler. And then also, like, I'm trying to do different things with my boutique to, you know, get more awareness, uh, marketing and things of that nature. Just get more awareness to my boutique and, you know, sell. So it's just a lot. It's just a lot, you guys, you know, and then also just other things in life. So... It's just like, oh man, I feel like I'm not doing enough. And in the other aspect, it's just like, oh, I feel like I'm always in the bed resting. But it's just like, well, you are pregnant. You got to go sit down and rest. You know, you can't just be up out all the time doing stuff because you have to let your body rest for the baby. You guys, I'm trying to balance it all. It's crazy. Okay. Um. Oh, yeah. So I also just had an ultrasound last Thursday. It was... It was like a different ultrasound. It was like a more in-depth ultrasound where I had to see a specialist um, for the baby's heart. I guess at the regular ultrasound, they were saying everything looked good, but they, I guess they seen something in the heart and they just wanted to make sure that his heart was growing um, at the pace it was supposed to be growing, how um, the beats per minute, how it, you know, how it sounds. Also, um, I guess they said 
they looked like it was a hole in his heart but then once they did the in-depth ultrasound everything was perfect he was strong it was no holes in his heart he was just fine and i'm just like yay you know because that can scare any mother to be like you know something wrong with your child's heart or you know any type of normality you know so yeah i'm really excited about that he's fine and you know he's still growing okay he doesn't have like down syndrome or anything and so that is good as well for me um because then if he did have down syndrome then you know me and my husband will have to talk about what we want to do as in like not like terminate the pregnancy but just how would we want to raise the child because it's a lot so we would have to talk about like just a lot of different things we have down syndrome um in our family i don't know about his family but i know in mine and um i know it's a lot to handle so so yeah you guys that ultrasound went fine it was like an hour to an hour and a half and it went smooth. I got to see my baby, my baby boy. So yeah, guys, it was cool. It was cool. Um, okay, and also another thing is have I start preparing for his debut? So am I gonna have like a baby shower? Have I started like organizing? Have I even started shopping? And all of those are no. <laughs> So I have not started shopping. I have not organized anything anywhere for his for his debut. Um, I am going to have a baby shower since it's a boy. Everybody's like kind of like, oh, you need to have a baby shower because you need stuff for this boy. You cannot, you know, you, no, you let us help you. And I was like, okay, all right. At first I was like, mm, it's doing too much. And now I'm getting closer to it. I'm like, yeah, let me go ahead and have one because that is going to be a great help to me and my family with, you know, pampers, wipes, toys, you know, bibs and just all type of boy stuff, boy trinkets. So yeah, I'm. We're really excited. I feel like it's. Oh my god! Like the closer it gets, the more I'm not like. What? How can I say? It? It's like the closer it gets, the more it seems like I'm not getting prepared. And it's like I'm a procrastinator. Ugh. I'm getting better at that. I've been saying that for a while, but I have gotten better with procrastination. Now that I'm a mother, like you have to plan stuff. If you don't plan stuff, you gonna look a hot mess, and your child is too. So I definitely plan, but I have not planned anything yet for the debut of our son. But in due time, I will. Um, I'm not going to shop or anything until after the baby shower. So the baby shower, he's due on Thanksgiving. Yay, turkey baby. Um, so we're going to have the baby shower in October. Everybody's birthday is in October, which is a hot mess. So... The baby shower gonna happen too in October. It's gonna be in mid October, you guys. And so I'm really excited. Um, yeah, like I said, after that, I'm going to go shopping for my baby. And yeah, I keep you guys updated. So I would show you my belly, but I don't know. Eh. Let me see. Mm, there's my belly. <sighs> oh, okay. Oh my god, he's so heavy. My belly's so big. Uh, but yeah, I'm a, I'm. A, I guess the next video, I'm gonna show you guys like my whole body, how I look and stuff like that. So I, I'm a solid person. I have not. I only gained like 15 pounds in this pregnancy. Thank you, God. Thank you. So I'm just like three more months to go. Come on, let's do another 15. And I'm good. Well, my daughter. Oh my god, I gained like 60 pounds. So and I have not lost that really. So. Yeah, so let's do a little 15 more so I can go ahead and lose that 50 and I'll be straight after the baby. Be looking sexy again. So. <laughs> Never mind me, you guys. But yes, thank you guys so much for, uh, I'm going to wrap up this video. Thank you guys for watching. Um, rate, comment, and subscribe. Please tell me how your journey is going if you're pregnant or if you have any questions. Just leave them down below. And yeah, bye guys. <laughs>